let's take up a question on uh, the preparation of the capital account of the deceased partner right now i'll put the question here aarti bharti and sonu shared profits as 5 is to 3 is to 2 right the total capital of the firm was rupees 8 lakhs held in their profit sharing ratio right they had a joint life policy joint life uh, let's put it as joint life insurance policy for rupees 1 lakh 20000 and the annual premium of the policy rupees 2000 was charged to the profit and loss account the year end zone 31st december 2002 right the partnership agreement provided that each partner is entitled to a salary of rupees 5000 per month right on the death of a partner the goodwill will be valued at 2 years purchase of average profits average of last Two years profits, right? Uh, then profits up to the date of death shall be calculated on the time basis on the average of last uh, two years of. Two years profits. There's one thing here. This goodwill. Two years purchase of average profit of last three years. Not two years. This is three years here, right? Okay. Now I come to the fourth point. Six percent per annum. interest on capital is allowed and no interest on drawings which were rupees 12500 up to the date of death right okay now bharti died on 15th august 2003 the profits for the last 3 years have been given 2002 it is 4 lakh 15000 2003 it is 4 lakhs and 2004 sorry Have to go backwards here. Two thousand two, two thousand one, two thousand two, two thousand one, and two thousand. For two thousand, it is three lakh eighty five thousand. Right now, the question is. Okay, they have also given this Arti and Sonu. Share profits as four is to three, right? Prepare 
Bharti's capital account. This is what you have to do, right? Okay, now first of all, let's see. First of all, let's find out the gaining ratio, right? The gaining ratio, fine. Now, the new ratio is given to you and the old ratio is also given to you. So, it's simple. 4 is to 3 is the new ratio. The old ratio is 5 is to 3 is to 2, correct? So, what is the gaining ratio? Gaining ratio is equal to new ratio minus old ratio. So, here for RT it will be 4 divided by 7 minus 5 divided by 10, right? That comes to how much? 5 upon 70, right? Same way for Sonu, it will be 3 by 7 minus 2 by 10, right? So, here the denominator is 70, right? And here it will be 10 threes are 30 minus 7 twos are 14, right? So, it comes to 16 upon 70. So, what is the gaining ratio? The gaining ratio is equal to 5 is to 16, correct? So, here we have calculated the gaining ratio. Now, let us come to the calculation of goodwill. Calculation of goodwill. Now, I have to find out the average profits of the last three years. The question they have given uh, will be valued at two years purchase of the average last three years profits, right? So, here the last three years profit that is given to you is uh, 4 lakh 15,000 plus 4 lakhs plus 3 lakh 85,000 divided by 3, right? So, if you do this, it will come to 4 lakh 15,000 plus 4 lakhs plus 3 lakh 85,000 divided by 3 is 4 lakh, right? There is one more zero here. Okay. So, this comes to 4 lakhs. Fine. Now, it has to be valued at 2 years purchase. 2 years purchase. So, that is 4 lakh into 2 which comes to 8 lakhs. Right. Now, 8 lakh. Now, I have to find out the debt partner's share. So, Bharti's share will be equal to 8 lakh into 3 by 10. 5 is to 3 is to 2. We have the ratio 5 is to 3 is to 2, right? Here. And so, this is 8 lakhs into 3 by 10 which comes to 2,40,000. Now, this 2,40,000, this will be distributed in the gaining ratio of RT and Sonu, right? So, that is 2,40,000 into 5 by 21. 5 is to 16 was the gaining ratio. So, 2,40,000 into 16 upon 21, right? This comes to 57,143 and here it will come to 1,82,857, right? So, the calculation of goodwill is over. After that, you have the calculation of profits up to the date of death. Right here again. Now you have to find out the average of last two years profits. Fine. So that is four lakh fifteen thousand plus four lakh divided by two.
divided by 2 right so that comes to uh, it will come to how much 4 lakh 7500 right okay now profit up to 15th August this is done on the time basis right profit up to 15th August that is how many months seven and a half months right so that will be equal to four lakh seven thousand five hundred um into seven and a half by 12 actually right so uh, divided by 12 will come here and when I do seven and a half uh, it will become 15 upon 2 right it's basically four lakh seven thousand five hundred into seven and a half divided by 12 right so it will come like this uh, and this will be two lakh fifty four thousand six eighty eight right now here you will calculate Bharti's share of this amount that is 3 by 10 into 2 lakh that comes to how much 76406 right so this is the share of profit fine now let's make the capital account now Bharti's capital account right here you have this fine now let's put down the items on the credit side first by balance brought down now the opening balance that is given is 8 lakh so 8 lakh into her profit sharing ratio that is 3 by 10 right so that comes to 2 lakh 40 thousand fine interest on capital interest on capital will be at 6 percent for seven and a half months right this is at 6 percent for seven and a half months on the capital if you calculate this um, it will come to 6000 right and then by profit and loss adjustment account that is uh, profit up to the date of death right this we calculated this is 76406 right by RT this is the goodwill right this also you calculated that is 57143 and by sonu this is again goodwill right this was 1,82,857 right and then there is a joint life policy uh, the joint life policy amount was 1,20,000 and um, again that will be put in the profit sharing ratio so 1,20,000 and into 3 by 10 that comes to 36,000 fine salary is given at the rate of 5,000 per month so this is 5,000 into 7.5 months right so that will come to 37,500 okay now here two drawings they have given the drawings amount no interest on drawings is charged so that's it after that you don't have anything so this is two Bharti's executor account so whatever is the balancing figure that will be transferred to the executors account right so this way you will prepare the capital account of the deceased partner and this closing uh, balance that will be transferred to the executor of Bharti right 
So with that, I'll come to the end of this session. In this, I have explained how to prepare the capital account of the deceased partner.